guys welcome to the wedding series sister edition my sister is getting married by august 13th or she has already gotten married by this time by august 13th saturday this is going to be her first outfit it is called an aqua cha and this is the design was brought by my sister she saw someone on ig came to the couturist her name is farida kuto i will put her instagram handle in the description box below she lives in asaba and she absolutely killed the dress she did exactly what we wanted and replicated it so yeah she is just trying to see which part needs to be adjusted if it's tight enough etc etc okay this hip side, this the hip yes, side. The hip side. I think the line is going to be easier. Yeah. 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 These are going to let you. You're going to be doing all this lace. You know that thing. Peter wants to do my nails. Hello. I see you as you leave. I feel it. I see it. The last time I saw you guys was yesterday, which was Thursday, I think 4th of August, because my sad dress fitting took like two hours. Then I went to go get some things that I wanted to gift her. Sorry for that. I went to go get some things that I wanted to gift her as her wedding gift. I want to like create a box of stuffs that I think she really like. Fingers crossed. <laughs> and by the time I came back, okay. I, I don't know if I mentioned I was going to pick up Waybill, but I was supposed to go and pick up Waybill. And this is Waybill. I can't show too much before I go and show you guys my address. I got my scissors and let's tear it open. Um, what is inside this package is my sister's civil dress. So I have to be careful with the scissors because I'm a, I'll cry like a baby if anything happens. Tearing it, tearing it. Oh, I can see the dress. I want to open it, but I feel like I should leave it for her to open by herself so I will not be showing you guys her dress. It's inside here. But this is the start of the day. Huh? So, guys, at this moment, I'm going to be putting my friend's page on the screen right now. Her name is Studs and Orbs by venus she sells jewelry she's the one i get all my amazing rings from like oh my god are you guys seeing this beauty oh my goodness oh my goodness i got four rings from her and it came in like this cute pouch oh my god i'm so excited oh my god i'm so excited oh my goodness like Obviously, I'm not wearing all at once, but you guys see how beautiful this is. And I can attest for how durable her jewelries are. Like, the last rings I got from her are still sturdy. They've not washed. Nothing have shifted in the gold. Like, it's really... I know it's not real gold. It's gold-plated, but it's, it's really good. Like, I have a bracelet from her. Okay, I'm putting it on. What am I even saying? I have this bracelet from her from 300 level. That's when she started selling her jewelry or that's when she started her jewelry business. But now she has, she's officially on Instagram. So please go and follow her. Check out her page. Um, Guys, guys, these jewelries are so fine. My God. Oh, I wanted this one to be... Yes. Are you guys... Let me tear the paper. Sure. Oh my God. This one is so cute. It's like a D or something. Oh my goodness oh my goodness and then the last one is this one ah oh, perfecto this one is a little big oh my god i wanted them all big because like i do you know i wanted to be able to wear them on different hands because like sometimes i estimate that my fingers are 
smaller than they actually are like i'm currently wearing a size eight this one is a size nine enough of talking you guys seen how fine these rings are and guess how much they go for just 3k compared to other ig kind of ig vendor jewelry person do that please follow my friend i really appreciate if you get jewelries from her thank you thank you okay i'll see you guys i'll see you guys then bye hi guys today is sunday because i needed to go to the market or nicha market to be specific i crossed that bridge because there are some things i needed to buy and i was not about to order them online when on is 500 naira away from me no i went to my mom that was a good thing so she could help me price because you know hi hey, guys they cheat if you see let me tell you guys the trick tonight the trick to nigeria market is that if you're going make sure you price in like three or four in fact four places price the least amount take the money that they tell you and divide it into half then tell them that half if possible even go below the half then check three other places apart from that place that just told you the price if the price is within the same range then you can go back and haggle some more because the moment the first person tells you he will not even say it's because of you i'm even giving you this price and you believe them it's over but let me let me let me show you guys this i got because you're so fine i'm going to start off with the first item i already launched it today to church oh my god i like i, I love it it's quite small enough like i know it looks big now because it's very close to the camera but it's small it's petty enough for me to carry to go to you know wherever i want to go to and it still contains quite a bit of things actually like let me see if i can open it up and show you guys like the inside but it doesn't have much holes it has this small flap i kept like my small phone in it today i put my purse inside it can contain my purse it can contain my phone it can even contain my jota for church contain my jota for church so it wasn't that bad there is this cute purse oh my god i want to I got a black heel. I'll show you guys later in the video. I got a black heel and I want to wear it with this black beautiful purse for my sister. They hand it inside for my sister's wedding. <laughs> I'm so excited. As sister of the bride, I have to show up, you know. Be proud and very saucy. <laughs> but anyway, I got this cute purse for about 6000 They cheated me. I priced in other shops, it was within that price range, so I was like, okay, it's not so bad, and I took it. Only for me to go to another shop, as I was about going home, the girl now told me, okay, I should take it 5-5. Five, five. My 500 naira. But at least they didn't cheat me by that much margin. Because... Would have killed a lot. I'm telling you. Look at my face. Like I could have killed a lot of people. <sighs> hmm. Guys. Hmm. I don't even know if I should do a story time. Like yesterday, we wanted to get some souvenirs for my sister's wedding. And my mom was like, she wants to get a particular trail for it. We found the trail. The first person was telling us some prizes. My mom was like, no, let's check another place. So we found another place that seemed like a much bigger shop. So my mom was like, oh, definitely, we'll get her the much cheaper rate here. Only for us to find out that man, he charged about like 9,000 something for those trails. We went to another shop later on to buy another set of souvenirs. And we asked them, like we saw the same trails and we're like, good, let's just use style and act, right? And then we asked and the guy was like, you give us for 7,000. Two, five. <sighs> Guys, learn from my mistake. This heel. This, <laughs> this is like my favorite item in this box. I mean, in this bag of things I bought. Because yesterday, my leg wanted to die. It's this cute sleeper's heel. Oh my God like i know it doesn't maybe it doesn't look like much but i promise you it looked beautiful when i wore it i don't know if i'm going to insert a clip of me wearing it i think i should do that so you guys can see how fine it looks on the label it's so cute this went for eight thousand there was the cheaper version it had one kind of like glass wedge thing it was the cheaper alternative and it wasn't this brand it was the cheaper alternative that one was going for about seven thousand but i preferred how this heel looks like and i made sure to ask in like three four shops 
I threatened, I said, oh, God, so you want me to be going? All the haggling techniques and shenanigans, some more, they no grill, they say 8K last. And because of how nice it was, I was like, I will splodge. They splodge? I don't know. But I was like, I will go for it. It was, I have to. Next on our list is slippers. Let me show you guys. This slippers is so beautiful and so original. Like, it is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. It went for four five. I checked more than 10 shops in Onicha yesterday. I said the trekking I did, my leg is still pinning me. This slippers, it went for 4.5. It is absolutely beautiful. It is sleek. It is something, I like this particular type of slides because you can wear it to uh, maybe not so casual outings if you don't think that you want to look too serious but you still don't want to look too. This one went for 1,008 last. I got flat shoe for work. This cost 2005 baby, and it is so cute. I know it won't be the most durable, but it will work. It's work, it will work. I want to go your far away. traveling for her court wedding i'm going to flip the camera and show you guys she's looking so fine she's sitting out here that's why i'm looking at her <laughs> but today is tuesday she's about to travel for her court wedding and she has some documents to sign we are going tomorrow which is the actual date wednesday 
for the actual ceremony of the court wedding she's going to be me because the court that is here in nasaba that does you know marriage is ugly it's in shambles so we are going to be need to do it i'm going to flip the camera and i'll show you the hot bride to be say hi to youtube no oh your lash is so fine but guys seriously the lashes are so fine these are a classic lash she did so good like see the nails now mm -hmm. easy easy <laughs> nails not agree i'll do bracelet anymore <laughs> don't go fix nails with no fendo bracelet anymore that's the box and yeah next time i'm going to see you guys is going to be tomorrow when i'm going for the court wedding when i'm all dressed bye guys <laughs> Show, 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 show